His name had came up in the investigation earlier. Uh, we did speak with him earlier in the case. Um, we were not able to charge him at that time. Wyatt Williams was arrested on drug and gun charges two days after police say DeQuante Hobbs Jr. was shot and killed. The seven-year-old was sitting at his kitchen table eating a bedtime snack at the time. The community has kind of rallied behind DeQuante this summer, uh, he rallied behind his family, provided us with leads and suggestions and tips. According to the arrest report from earlier this year, police got tips that Williams had been involved in the shooting. We need to talk to those people and, and get them to tell us what happened. Detectives say Williams had been hanging out, playing dice in a yard near Hobbs's home when the shooting happened. He had pulled a gun and, and shots were fired in the direction of, of someone else. Um, and one of those bullets went through DeQuante's window. A bullet hit the seven-year-old in the neck. He died at Norton Children's Hospital later that night. Wednesday would have been his first day of second grade. But unfortunately, he's not here to see his, his, see his classmates, his friends, his teachers, and his loved ones, his family. Detectives say tips from the community helped them charge Wyatt Williams with murder. There were several people that, that did speak up. So putting all those together, um, putting all those statements together is what we got us here today.